Hey guys, welcome back. We're playing Something's in the Ice. Some thing. Thing is in the ice. Um, this is a game done by just Tom Cuck. Tom Cuck. Alright, well, let's let's start it. 2015, a team of scientists from the Antarctica station Zer Zer Zaria. Oh my god, my English. Took sam ice samples for research from a depth of two kilometers. Just as they were about to return to base, a severe snowstorm began. Once they reached the base, they went down into the old bunker as security protocol instructed them to do. For the thing from the ice. Notice the, the emphasis on thing. You know? Thing. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, what's this? Oh, I grab. Okay, it's a door. Dude, um... I mean, I shouldn't move my head a lot. It's kind of disorienting. The atmosphere looks really good. Guys? Oh? Anybody? Hey, what's up, man? What do we, uh... Where's, where's the... Object from under the ice. You're creepy looking as hell. Listen, remind me why I work in this godforsaken abandoned hole. Um, well, Victor, it's it's our job. It's what we get paid for. Are you talking about the Arctic or this Cold War bunker? Oh, that's me. Sorry. About the bunker. It's so creepy here at times. I yeah, get scared. It's scary for me here too. And regarding your question, hold you me, Victor. That strong storm that started, and we had to come down here. Plus, it's good that there's an old laboratory down here. That way we didn't have to move the equipment from the station. Yes, I remember. The question was rhetorical. God, in two years with us, you still haven't learned to understand my jokes, Victor. Well, I'm sorry. I'm kidding. Okay, about those samples we found. You'd better ask our microbiologist about that. I guess I'll, I will. You just do your own little weird tea pose. Hey, Victor, what have I told you about leaving the uh, refrigerator open? Now the opened can of beer. Oh, my God. Botulism going on in there. All right, well, uh, you enjoy that. Got some vodka. That's good. A lot of vodka. We'll need that. All right, I'll go find... Uh, I take your flashlight now. I'll go find the biologist. I can't remember who, uh, who that is. I don't know if I bumped my head on the way down into the bunker, but uh, I, yeah, I don't remember who's the uh, bio... Oh! Wolf man? No, girl. Are you, uh... What are you doing? It's Maya. I was gonna call her Maya, because she looks like Maya from Green Hell. Hello, Maya. How are things going here? It's good that there's equipment here, and we can properly study the samples. Properly? That's what I'm asking. Well, what do you think? What did we find? I'm not exactly sure yet, but it looks like some kind of microorganism. What do you mean by microorganism? Like a really small like we organism? We were looking for, Thomas. We need to examine these samples to understand exactly what they are. Let's observe further. Are you an AI? You sound like an AI. Okay, I'll go contact the Zveda... Says Zavada? Zev? I, I don't know how to pronounce all these, these consonants together. Or, uh, the other station. The storm should have reached them by now. I'll find out if they went down on the shelter. To the shelter. They didn't go down on it. I wouldn't think. I should contact the, the Zelda station. Once again, I think this is like Russian or something. I don't, I don't speak it. Oh yeah, no, this is definitely some kind of Russian or some shit. Water tanks. How did, how, how are we doing science down here? This place is an absolute shithole. What a mess. Is there a radio room here somewhere? Looks like radio equipment. This is storage of some kind. Dog food. Oh, dude, this is totally... Yes, we definitely found a thing in the ice. I 
Uh, no, these are the fuse panels. Okay. Let's try to remember that. Can I run? Oh, I can. I'm like the wind. Running scared. We have a... Does that say radio? And we have a telephone. This is Aria Station calling Zelda Station. Can you hear me? I repeat, Zelda Station. Can you hear? I can hear you, Zarya. Uh, how you doing there? Did you manage to go down to the shelter? Yeah, we're here. We're doing fine. Only our newcomer turns out to be claustrophobic. He doesn't seem to be doing too well with this tight quarters. Burn. Who even sent him down here? Damn scientist. Are you related to Hank Hill? Uh, well, I heard someone from the government insisted on this transfer to the station. Well, of course they did. Damn government. By the way, Ma said you guys found something interesting. None of your business. I don't. I mean, I, I don't know uh, if it's in that interesting. She's trying to find out what we found. Okay, keep us posted. We'll yep, keep us informed. Explore that rock we came across yesterday. Okay, you look at the rock, and okay. I'm gonna Over. wander wander around and not make any phone calls. Maybe he was some kind of AI too. I don't know. Maya's definitely like she sounds like AI. She's a bot. Nothing in there. So far, so good. I really can't believe that we're doing any kind of scientific experiments here. What's up, gang? Conspiring against me? What are we doing? What are we, guys? Guys. You. What? Guys? What do we, what do we do? What are we doing? What's happening here? I'm just waiting on her. I need to pour some tea and rest a bit. Oh, okay. Just a uh, little, little tea. Oh, it glows there. That's really obvious. That's some damn good tea. Jesus Christ, Vic Victor. Damn it, Victor, why the hell are you creeping on me? I was poured bawling on her water on you. He didn't creep, he sprinted. Sorry, Thomas. Maya's calling you. She says she's discovered something. <sighs> I'm too old to deal with your shit. You're giant. Can't drink my tea? Is it green tea? Bastard. You scared the shit out of me. Why would you sprint at me like that? Hey, what's up? Hey, Thomas. We're all telepaths here. What's what what's up, Maya? You just won't believe it. And you better put that mug on the table. Take a look at this. You guys are ruining tea time. Put my mug on the table. What table? Here? Alright, I'll just I'll just look at it. Yeah, this looks like germs. That's bad, isn't it? I think it's bad. Can I drink this? No. That's a Odd shoot, odd clothing for the Antarctic. <laughs> what? What did I just see? You just saw an ancient organism awakening after being frozen in ice for thousands of years. Wait, 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 how is it, how is that possible? I don't know. We need to report this as soon as possible and get down to research. Do you have everything you need here? I have some clothes. Not quite everything we, that is needed, doing? but there is. We need to somehow send a sample to our guys from the institute. I, I agree. Okay, keep researching. I would take a rest. Anyway. Contact the Hawaiian Institute of Microbiology. Tell them that we what we found. Maya, describe everything to them in detail. I'll go take a nap and a dump, maybe, and I'll wait for the storm to be over. Then we'll uh, think about sending these samples out to a laboratory in Hawaii, alright? Alright, break. I think my room's over here. Creepy chains. Ah, man, I wish I could drink this. This is in my room. Where do I rest? Not here, huh? The bed glow. Maybe I'll stay in. I thought that. I thought that was my room. I'm gonna stay in Victor's room. Oh, I'm just gonna lay on the couch with the guitar. Just curl up with the old git box. Ah. Perfectly safe down here in our, our bunker. There's nothing happening. Huh? 
Who's rattling chains? Victor. Er. Victor. Maya. Dude. Dude. Take a nap. You guys are acting all weird. Maya, Victor, where are you? Guys? What are you guys doing? Stupid piece of... Hey, mouth. Language. What's happened? Have you contacted Hawaii? They didn't get in touch. Damn radio doesn't even work anymore. Just static. Worked a minute. It was probably because of the storm. Yeah, I just used it. Likely. Or maybe it's because it's a Cold War bunker and all the equipment is older than we are. Yeah, okay, I'll try to fix this thing, and uh, you can do something else for now. Really is a weird outfit she's wearing. You just grab this bucket of shit. That. Some of this. Hammer that. Ugh. Hey, what are you guys doing? Everything is fine. Are you bored? Well, of course, it's boring here. What are you looking at? Dude. Oh, your bowls are empty. You guys want to eat, right? I'll, I'll bring it to you now. I'll go get some food. Hold on. I remember seeing it. I can't get through over here, can I? No. Okay. So we're using an old Cold War bunker in Antarctica. Wasn't it down here? Oh, it's right there. I didn't close this. Get you some tasty treats. Just doing our normal chores. Oh my god, dude. There's only two dogs. Do I have to open the door to get it? Ah, here we go, pups. I like to close my eyes when I feed the dogs. Just imagine, did I just pee in something? What the hell? Oh, there's three. Where'd the other dog come from? All right, three dogs. No turds, at least. All right, well, I'll just leave the whole bag of food in there with you guys, and uh, we'll get some fresh air in a while. We'll just go, we'll go out playing in the snow. Just be patient, all right? Now. Well, I fixed the radio. I can't use it. Guys, why do you guys keep running away from me? What are you guys doing? Hey, wait. I'll pour a cup of tea and talk to Maya. I just never drink this stuff. What's up, Victor? What well, are you doing? What are you going to do? Uh, I'll rest in a bit. Continue trying to fix the radio. That's not what I'm talking about. The radio works. It's just that the signal can't get through because of the storm. What do you mean? Are we Come banging? On. I can see the way you look at her. Don't make this up, Vic. We are scientists. We don't have time for office romances. Okay, I like her. So what? Well, why are you waiting? Life is too short. I once missed my chance with a beauty from the Institute. Why'd you miss it? When do we... <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> nope. It was a very long time ago. Yeah, I see. She worked with me on a project. We seem to get along. You asked, asked her out. You guys had a good time. And then what? I was sent to Cronenheim Station. And then here. So three years have passed. Yeah, our work is merciless when it comes to our personal lives. Yeah. Yeah. Why am I telling you this? Because you work together. And for a long time. For you, work is not a hindrance, but rather a connecting link. Mm. So go to her and talk about something. We've been stuck in this bunker for God knows how long. Damn romance. You're right. Life's too short. I'll go check on her and see how the work sample's going. Maybe we can talk about something else. I'll try to cast a bait. A bait. Yeah, yes. While you masturbate. Find out from her how things are going with the samples. And don't forget to ask her to examine your sample. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a joke you are, Vic. That's probably what I'll do. Yeah, yeah. I was already told about this. Okay, so don't be upset about that girl, okay? But just don't. You seem like a grown man. Yeah, you we'll calk you later. All right, fine. Sam yep, samples. Samples. Okay, okay, I got it. Samples, my. I got. I know what you mean. Holy shit, Vic. What are we nine? 
Where's my cup of tea? I'm gonna have a cup of tea and try to make moves on Maya. Time to go work some magic without a cup of tea, I guess. Still in here? Oh, it's almost like you're waiting for me to come talk to you about stuff. Hey, Thomas, you won't believe it. Maybe. How are we doing here? I discovered something interesting here. Oh? These organisms respond to light. How's that? I did a little experiment. I shined a laser on them and they seemed to go into hibernation. Activity dropped sharply. But when I turned off the laser, activity was restored. After I noticed this, I decided to try placing them in an airtight box that didn't let any light in. And you know what? What? They've multiplied. Wow! Yes, can you imagine? I kept the box in the dark just for a minute, and they doubled in number. So how is this possible? So they reproduce in the dark? I mean, that's it what microbes, like they reproduce And I noticed stuff. something else. Huh? <laughs> when I conducted an experiment with light, I dimmed the lights in the room and began to observe. I saw the most active of them seem to devour the weak and less active and become larger in size. What does this mean? They're cannibals. Let me try to explain. Imagine if wolves would eat old or sick wolves from their pack. And then God, they my guy is so bigger, stupid. more active and stronger than before. Uh-huh. Yeah, sounds interesting. That's right. And to be honest, it scares me a little. We'll put him in the light. Okay, I think that's enough work for today. We did a good job. Especially you, Maya. That's for sure. I'm tired as a dog. It's already late. We should all get some sleep. Maybe the storm will be over by the morning. Yeah. I hope so. I feel uneasy in this bunker. Yeah, me too. You bastards don't move your lips when you talk to me. Well, okay. I'll go to sleep then. Okay, I guess I'm too. <laughs> Good night and sweet dreams, Thomas. Good night to you, Maya. What, we're just gonna leave them in the box all night? Okay. I'm sure nothing will happen. I should have asked her to tea or something. What a fool I am! Hey, you wanna walk next door and cuck Victor? With tea? No. Okay. Oh, I gotta tell him about. Oh god. Not gonna lay there. Do I have to talk to Victor again? No. Okay, I'm just gonna go to bed. Oh, we all sleep in the same room. I just realized there's three beds in here. Hey, Vic. Vic. This is gonna be awkward as shit. If Maya and I make a connection. All right, sleep on this nasty. They're always the most stained mattresses. Uh, just look around and go to bed. Close your close your lace doily curtains. There's something in the ice. Huh? It's an odd noise. Or, uh, I don't know what that's about. Damn heaters are turned off. Can't take a lantern or a flashlight. Victor's gone. Ah, looks like Maya didn't even go to bed last night. A little dark in here. What happened? Where's the lights? Hey, get Maya? What happened around here? Holy shit. Victor was just trying to distract me so him and Maya could make time. I mean, by make time, I mean do it. Vic! Victor? Victor, bud, are you here? Where are you? Hey, close the refrigerator. No, no, Victor, nope. There's no one here. Well, they left the vodka. Run out here.
Pretty dark. It's damn dark. Not going without a flashlight. Oh, I'm gonna go get that flashlight I wanted. Nice. Why is the vent open? I saw that. I think I saw it in the bedroom. Oh, I did. Give me that. F. Can I crouch? Yeah, something in the vents, bud. Oh, what the hell? Great, looks like all the power's gone out. Good thing I have a flashlight. Blood, what the hell is going on here? How come I didn't notice that before? What? I didn't hear anything while I was in the other room. Victor, you alright, bud? Oh, don't run. I might slip on it. Well, this is when we get the hell out of here. Maya, you're still not in here, are you? No, good. Well, I know where the fuses are. Puppies? Oh, the puppies. Guys? My butthole can't handle all this. You know that I have like an exceptionally tender butthole, right? Can't can't turn the power back on? Um That really sucks. Wait, there's light over here. Why is there a light in here? Guys. Sarah, it's Zip. Huh? How can you? Okay. Over. This is Zelda Station. Yeah. What's going on? Calling. I hear you. There, there's problem with electricity oh, here. Yeah. You found is dangerous. What? Please, there's, there's any Please report. Zarya, I repeat, the stone that found this the remains, remains of an of ancient, ancient, an alien, a, a, this asteroid. More than eight thousand. Please repeat, heavy interference. I can't hear. I mean, I hear enough. Find Radiation maybe, background simply colossal. Your samples possibly related. That stone. Stupid old radio fucking storm. I can't hear shit. Ah, great. It's completely lost now. Ah, let's make a couple words. Uh, something about a stone. Oh, no, I know what he was talking about. Ancient. Yep. Oh, that was some kind of nonsense. I hope everything's okay there. I mean, some kind of nonsense. Are you thick? Oh, it's cold in here. Guys? Guys, what are you barking at here? What happened? You scared of the dark? Everything's fine. Don't be afraid. There's definitely nothing in the vents. Everything is perfectly fine. Just, uh, play with your bones and... and eat food. Chew on the floor and we'll be fine. Seems the dogs are afraid of the dark. I need to bring them a gas lamp. Maybe it'll make them feel better. Oh, I know where that is. It's in my room. There was one next to my bed. Yes, there was. There's no people here. Wonder where Maya and Victor went, right? He's just now thinking about it. Hmm. Wonder where they went. I should definitely go through those. Victor? Victor's gonna scare the shit out of me. He's gonna come running at me again. Something stupid. Ah. Now I have tons of light. Still doesn't bother me one bit that I don't see either one of these guys here. I'm totally... Everything's fine.
Okay. Um. Come in here. That's it, guys. Don't be afraid. Now you have more light than me. Uh, you got food, water, so be good little dogs while I look for Maya and Victor. We're most certainly not already dead. Because they're nowhere. That's stuck. That's bad. There's light down here. Radio room. I see light here. Thought. Am I tripping? It's just the radio room. You guys pooping? Oh, we just... We shit standing up, do we? No doors. We just stand here and shit. A unisex bathroom, we're just walking, everybody's just standing around shitting. I'd, I'd rather sit down. I definitely should walk around this shit. What are you? What is that? What happened? What the fuck is that? I should have seen that coming. How did that make me shit my pants so hard? You guys didn't see anything, huh? Jesus Christ. Uh. Why is this door open? And where does the blood come from? This door? Dogs are good. That's weird. The light from this room bleeds out in here. You guys are still not here. All right, I go back to that tendril room, apparently. Wait, what's this? Guys? You hanging out with the water? No. Obviously, we have to get back into this room. With all of that. Oh man, what is this? Looks like some kind of growth. They're organic. Yeah, no, 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 shit. It's the thing from under the ice. Need to find the guy as soon as possible. Shouldn't this mess with it? I'm shining lights on it. Check the room with the generator. I think I heard something from there. Dogs are dogging. Well, that's convenient. Why is the generator turned off? Oh, you're breathing. Can't, can't turn this fucking thing back on? What? I didn't even see it. What happened? Oh, fuck. What? What was it? What did I say? What are you... I'm in the generator room. What do I... I can't do anything in here. Somebody was breathing. The flashlight turned off. Oh, what the hell am I doing? Dog's still good.
Victor. My, come on, guys. Huh. Life form appears to, uh, to poop. Okay. Is there a light in the generator room now? No, it's just the dogs. The hell? What do you? What do we want? What am I? What am I doing? What do we do? I didn't turn the generator back on. I don't know why. Can I turn the generator on now? Dogs are good. No. And there's nobody to be found, just this stuff. Um about that? Can I grab that? No. This? What do I what am I doing? When do I die? I mean, I, I don't know why there's snow in here either. It is cold. Why? What do I do? All three dogs are still here. Lamp's still lamping. I need to get the dogs to get the hell out of here. Um. Ah, backtrack this way. This thing is spreading at an alarming rate. I wonder what it is. And where did Maya and Victor go? I'm starting to worry. I mean, it's pretty obvious they were eaten by whatever the hell this is. Right? That's bad. Check the exit from the bunker. Maybe they're outside. Well, that's what I wanted to do in the first place, but you wouldn't let me. Remember, I was like, dude, we need to go. Victor? Guys? Did you guys go outside? Got oh, no. Dude, that's... Doesn't look like these doors are open. They can't be open at all. The snow flew in through the cracks and the door's been frozen. That's the best. Um. Now what's your plan, bud? Chip a pirate with a shovel or something like that? I mean, probably time to shit her pants. Victor? Maya? Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, you're shitting me, right? This is, this is amazing. I would... 100... No, yeah, yep. Yeah, no, no fucking way. That was Victor. Oh, Jesus! What is it? Stop doing that! Don't touch me! Oh no, stop it! Whatever that is, stop doing that! The fuck was that? Something bit me! Oh no. Oh my god. They're everywhere! Dogs. Parking again. Why? I need to check this quickly. See if everything was okay. 
What do you th Ow. I don't feel like myself anymore. Guys! Got it. Ow, why, why the screen thing? No! No, you leave them! No! Puppies! Turn the light. Stop turning the light off. Oh, God, no. Let's go in there and try to. Can I rescue them? Puppies? Oh, puppies. Ah, <sighs> weird things keep happening. Something dragged those dogs into the ventilation. Yeah. Yep. How come we never tried to start the generator to get the lights going again? I need to contact the Zelda station again. All right. Yeah, that's been working for us. You get a tool to try to get out or something. I mean, we're infected. We've been bit. That's it for us. Uh, I don't know if you can hear me, but we have an emergency here. Two of my team are missing. I can't find them. Also, there's some kind of evil here. It seems to, something has killed our dogs. There's something strange, organic substance everywhere. Please answer. I don't know what to do. Please, please answer. Shit in my pants. Guys. Well, that didn't work. I need to get out of here quickly. Things gone everywhere. It's spreading very quickly, and it, 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 what it did to the dogs, I'm over it. Okay. Something run by? What was that? Fucking hell. Well, how are we getting out? I like said the door's frozen. Is it not frozen now? Did it thaw out? I hear people talking and shit behind us. It's gotta be one of them, right? Oh god, there's something in there. Are you just gonna let me out now? I can't. I can't get out. What do I do? Fucking need to clear the way of the snow. I can't do it with my bare hands. Seems there was a shovel in the bunker somewhere near the laboratory. Bro, you're so far behind. Way behind. Vic? Maya? Oh, yeah, shovel's right there. Guys, um... Guys? Hey, Vic, you can have Maya. You know, I... You deserve to, to find love and to have a better life. I'm just gonna... just I'm gonna leave you guys to it, alright? We'll just, okay, I can't shut up, but I can't shut the door. I think I hear the dogs. Are they alive? I mean, we just saw Victor, Maya, whatever. Come on, come on! Get a freaking shovel! There's something in the ice. Oh, oh, fuck, it's cold. The storm doesn't seem to subside. She probably just, I don't give a shit. Right away in a, in a snow a snow machine, snowmobile. Some people call them snow machines. Are these signal lights? What the hell? Damn, bunker doors are open. Have the guys really gotten out of here? No. A lot of blood. You need to go to the base to get the keys to the radio room. And contact the station. Um. Here. Go upstairs? Oh, you know, it's cold, but it feels good. Kind of feeling a little under the weather, to be honest. Piss. I hope I didn't contract something when I got bit. Damn it. Why the hell are we locking all the doors in this place? Don't see anybody? What in the 
hell do I do? See, there's a door near the side. Here? I can't open any of the doors. Can't open any of the doors to the station. Wait, what am I supposed to do? There it goes. Hey, can you hear me? Seems normal in here. Please, someone answer. Wow, that's, that's exceptionally loud. Please, somebody. Victor, where are you? Woke up and you weren't there. There's something crazy. There's some crazy shit going on in that bunker, man. Something ate the dogs. They're all gone. Thomas, is that you? God, I'm so glad to hear you. Where are you? I'm in the hangar. I went to get fuel for the snowmobiles. I got pinned here. I, I think I'm bleeding. Don't move. I'll be right there. Okay, I'm waiting. Please hurry. The hangar, huh? What the hell is that? Should be like a giant building. Hanger. That's over there. Boob. He's he, no. We've seen the movie, all right. Been dancing around it, dropping little hints about the thing in the ice. All right, I'll go do this first. Go to the radio room. Really weird that the others would leave and not tell me or anything, you know? I'm guessing it's all the way up the highest point. Oh, I walked right by the door. Where is that? There it is. Not there. Which store is it? Um. What the shit? What does this keep friggin' open? There's a hangar over there. What, what are we doing? What am I even doing? What do we... What do you want me to do? Now you're telling me to go help. I was going to help Victor. You bastards. And you told me I have to... What was that? There's a light on. Seems like someone's knocking on the door. God damn it. I went to go help Victor. And then the game's like, you gotta go somewhere out. What? Oh, I wish I could make up my mind. I'm just delirious in the cold, running around in just like my khaki pants and a. Oh, yeah. Victor, please let me out. What? Victor, open up. What's gotten into you? What happened, Maya? Thomas? Is that you? Yes, it's me, Thomas. Why are you locked? It was Victor. He began to behave strangely tried to attack me. I screamed, hoping to wake you up. He blocked my path to you, and I got out of the bunker. What do you mean he attacked yes. you? He chased me all over the bunker, but I was able to get out, and he ran after me. When I ran outside, he caught up with me and locked me here. What the fuck? What? Why? I don't know. Please, let me out of here. Are the other doors also closed? How can I get you out? Yes. 
He closed all the doors in the laboratory. I don't know. I'll go look for him. You okay? I'm okay. But hurry up. He can come back. I don't be afraid. I'll be right back. I mean, I already picked up keys. What the hell are the keys I picked up? I picked them off right off the bat. What the hell's going on here? I just need to be safe. I need to help Victor. He should have the keys to the laboratory. I'll ask him about the situation. What? <laughs> uh, how long do I have to wait for you, Thomas? I think I'm getting worse. Oh, don't worry, buddy. Oh, wait, listen, I met Maya. You locked in the library laboratory. I'm very interested in what happened to you, too. You said you chased her there and then locked her in the lab? What the fuck? Hell. I don't trust her. It wasn't like that. She attacked me and tried to either bite me or scratch me. It was I who ran away from her and ran into the cold just to escape. I lured her into the laboratory at the base and locked her there. I wanted to refill the snowmobiles before waking you up, but I'm stuck. Okay, I'll be there soon. We'll figure it out, buddy. I've already seen it. I like a human thing walking around. In the base. Hope everything's okay with Victor. It's not. Vic? What's up, bud? Finally. That's a lot of blood, dude. What's going on? You sure know how to calm me down. I don't know. I just went to get fuel to start at least one of the snowmobiles, and suddenly all these boxes fell on my feet. Yeah, uh, we never knew what they were storing here. So, uh, what happened with you and Maya? Do you really want to fucking talk about this right now? I'm bleeding, man. Help me, please. All right, I'll do this. It looks heavy I as hell. I a pry bar in the hangar here. Like a long metal piece. All right, I'll look for it. Hurry. I can't feel my legs anymore. All right, be right back. Oh, he's, he's definitely a, a critter. I don't trust either one of you. And I'm, I, I got bit. We're all infected. We just need to, I need to set this place on fire. What the fuck? Well, there's something in here now. Hey, buddy, Vic, you all right? Well, Vic's, uh, no fucking way. <laughs> Victor? Need to find the keys to get my out of here. Ah, oh, shit, that's right. Yeah, because she's totally fine. God, sorry, Victor. You won't need these keys anymore, buddy. No more snowmobile rides for you. I don't like that. What is that? I don't like that. What? What was it? I didn't see nothing. I just heard stuff. And I got blood in my eyes. Why the hell do I keep turning off the light? What was that shit? Ugh, I need to free Maya quickly. It's, the light is on. It's very bright. She can attract this thing. What do you mean she can attract it? The light scares it away, remember? Is that Victor? Oh shit! Ah oh, shit! What the fuck was that? Oh, well, we already know. Hiya. Are you here? Jesus Christ! 
light on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Ow. me and Maya are going to make it. I got to contact you guys from the station. Ask for more help. Ask for help. Yeah, no. Yeah, so what we should do is get more people here. You never saw the movie, huh? Never saw the movie. No idea what's going to happen next, do you? Is there a radio upstairs? I just saw plants. How am I, uh... Psych floor? How, how do I... What am I doing? I used to have a radio on my hand. What happened? Is it gone? Oh, shit. There's a radio here. No way. I think there's some sounds coming from the bedroom. I need to check. No, I don't. Maya's having sex with the thing. What's going on, Maya? Maya, I thought it devoured you. How did you? I managed to escape just as he broke through the roof. What is this creature? I have no idea, but I saw something strange in a bunker after I saw what looked like a worm. Then I noticed the room was, which ran out, was full of growth. It seemed organic. Growths? Yeah, I decided to look for you and notice these growths in the rooms too. And then the dogs. What about the dogs? They're dead. Something dragged them in ventilation oh ate them all. My God. Yeah, what, what is going on here? When you and Victor fell asleep, I couldn't because of Victor's snoring. So I decided to go and do a couple more tests. It haunted me that these organisms, after so many years, were so active. I started watching them again. And then I decided to go have a cup of tea. And when I returned, I saw a broken test tube on the floor. Apparently, I accidentally touched it and dropped it while getting up from the table. You didn't even hear it break. What? Oh my god, Maya. I didn't do it on purpose. Anything can happen. Anyway, we have a whole block of ice with these samples. Well, I just took a rag and wiped the floor, then took the bucket of water and rag to the toilet. After that, I went to lie down on the sofa in the living room. Why did Victor attack you and you chase after him? What when was I going on? Up, I went to the toilet and Victor was there. He just stood there looking in the mirror, you know, like a zombie. And next to him, I saw an overturned bucket with a rag, and it seemed to me that the rag was covered in some kind of slime. What the fuck? So I asked Victor, but What's he up, didn't Vic? answer. Nothing. When I came closer, I saw his empty gaze. He turned to me, but it was like he was looking through me, you know? Kind of like you're doing to me now? And then what? He reached out to me and grabbed my hand. I started screaming and struggled to escape. I tried to run away from him towards you and wake you up, but he blocked my path. And then I remembered that in that part of the- You just ran away. It's okay. It's not okay. Victor ran after me, caught up with me at the base, and locked me inside the laboratory. It felt like something was controlling it. Well, that's fuck. For sure. Then he left, as if he heard a call. He walked toward the hangar. And after about 15 minutes, you came. We need to find him. Together, we can handle him. Tie him up, call for help. Uh, we can't do this. What do you mean we can't? Uh, he's in like 16 what? different parts. How? Uh, what the, the hell? This thing killed him. I tried to help, but Damn. yeah, he was fucking dead. What the hell have we gotten ourselves? I don't know, Maya. To be completely honest, I don't even want to know. All I know is I want to get us out. I'm, so I'm infected out too, probably. What's we need to contact the station so uh, the antennas are much more powerful so we can contract. Okay. Uh, Sounds like a. We'll ask him to take us out of this hell hole. The two of us definitely can handle it. Let's not act like heroes. We'll just call for help, and then we'll tell them what happened and let them decide what to do. Okay, that sounds reasonable. All right, there's no electricity, but we could try to power the radio from batteries. So I'll go to the hangar, get them. You stay here. It'll be safe. That way, that way, Maya, nothing, anything happens hey, to me. She has no nothing light. Nothing will happen to you. Okay. Yeah, I know. I've already been bit. Be a uh, yeah, barricade okay. stuff. All right. I'll be right back. You stay here in the dark. 
she's totally possessed or whatever. She's infected. All right, well. Right back in the hangar. This thing's just wandering around everywhere. There's no, no safe place. But be careful, there's creatures here somewhere. Well, it sounds like he's trying to eat Maya, so I think I'm safe. You got any batteries? If I were a battery, where the hell would I be? All the way back through all this. Why doesn't this stuff grab me? Just start eating my brains and shit. I mean, it makes sense, right? Just sitting here flatulating. Well, this is the battery I need. Just a car battery. I need to take these batteries to the radio room and plug the radio in them. Then we can finally call for help. You left me, Thomas. I did. Well, no, I actually went to save you. And, uh... The whatever this thing is. Gotcha. Is it, what, what are we supposed to do here? Didn't seem to care about the light. What am I doing? What am I supposed to do here? Just run? I've already, I've already been infected, dude. What was that? Th they said the thing in the beginning. They made a point. They, they made a point about, you know, using the light. What's up? There's samples of the laboratory in the third floor that we examined, so we must take them with us so we can properly study this. We have to take them. Call for help. I'll be there soon. What? You're an idiot. Fuck my stupid. We need to get rid of this shit, not take samples with us. I'm dead. We'll do that. We'll do this. Zarya Station. Answer. Can you hear me? This is Zarya. Is that you? Yeah. What the hell is going on? Maya said that you and Victor died. Maya said that you and Victor died. Now I hear your voice what the fuck? Loud and clear. What Why did she say phone? that? When? About an hour ago, Maya contacted us. She was crying. She said that Victor went crazy and attacked you and her. She said he fucking killed you. There's then some real fucked up thing. Minutes, Something fucked up going on here, man. That was you that told us what happened with the dogs and some gross that filled the bunker. Yep. We tried to answer you, but you didn't hear us. After that, we tried again to contact Maya, but she didn't answer us either. There's something in the ice samples we found. Maya said it was some kind of ancient microorganism. I don't know, but it evolved very... He evolved very quickly. Now this is no longer a microorganism, but a full-fledged monster running around our base, and it killed Victor. That sounds crazy, Thomas. Seriously. Fuck, this is no joke. <laughs> it fucking tore Victor to pieces, dude. It dragged the dogs into the fucking ventilation. The whole bunker's overgrown with some kind of organic matter. I have no idea what the hell is going on. Please get us out of here. Please, I repeat, this is not a joke. Okay. Everything will be fine, Thomas. Calm down. Did you say us? No fucking way I could call it. Yeah. Maya and I. She's waiting for me in the laboratory upstairs. So Maya is alive? Yeah, I'm here and Maya and, and this terrible monster. Okay, calm down, Thomas. Stay safe. We're already getting ready. We'll be there in about a half an hour. In what fucking sense within a half an hour? What? It takes about ten minutes to fly here with a helicopter. It's a storm. I know you're on edge, but have you seen this weather? 
The helicopter will blow away on takeoff. Yeah, this is this storm. Sorry, there's, there's so much going on. I'm just like, you know, I understand, I'm fucked Thomas. up. Listen, we'll be there soon. Most importantly, stay in a safe place. You understand? Yeah, I'll be waiting for you. Please hurry. I don't, I don't know how much longer I can hide from the shit. Over. Dude, Maya's infected. Obviously. Why did she lie to them? I need to go upstairs and check if she's okay. No, fuck her, dude. She, she's some kind of alien creature thing. She's already possessed. It's too late for her. She's donezo, bud. Donezo. I go around the other side to get to the door. Son of a bitch. Why are men so dumb? Hmm. Sounds like that thing's up there with Maya. They're in some kind of weird or alien sex. Maya? Why did you tell them I was dead? Like an hour ago? Maya. Well. <laughs> uh, what the fuck? Why did you come here alone? Why did you need these samples? They told you to stay away from me. Fuck, Maya. No fucking way. No, I won't wait for me. I need to get out of here on my own. Are your dogs? I need to check the fuel in the snowmobiles. Find the keys to somewhere. Maybe Victor had them when he when he died. What? They're alive? No, they're not. Can't move. You know damn well the dogs are dead, dude. You watched what happened. The hangar. Of course. This music sounds all help hopeful, like this good things are gonna happen to me. And maybe there's keys here too! Well, there's that thing. Looks like some kind of bug. A lot of things here now. God, Victor's right. She did lie to me. I think she was the first one possessed. I think it got her first. And then it made its way uh, to the dogs. That's gas can there. Grab that now. Okay. Oh, this gas can. That is definitely one of how it went down. Crouching. Every time I run, I stand up and I stop. All right. Hope oh, dogs aren't out here. Don't even look. Don't even look at it. Bad stuff. Well, they filled that up. Jump on the old snow machine and drive. 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 What are we doing? What are we flicking our bean, bud? What are we looking at? Get out of here. 
freaking dolt. I didn't, I didn't have anything to do with anyone. Punch it. Here come the other guys too. Scientists are already that we got fully automatic assault rifles and stuff. Well, thank God that's over. We won't worry about that bite. So you're saying that you were scratched by something underwater in the basement, right? I don't care about that. Do you listen to what I said? The damn thing killed Maya and Victor and all the dogs. We need to we need to fucking burn everything on that base, dude. So that the monster doesn't get out. We do realize that we need to ask you about what happened, right? It's our job. Yeah, yeah, sure. Sorry, so much has happened. It, you know, I just uh, thanks for getting me no out of problem, there. No problem, Mr. McReady. Okay, we'll continue later. All right. Do I walk towards this ominous red light? Ah, uh, oh, my head. What the. Oh, I'm probably fine. Uh, dude. Oh yeah, they know. They know. I'm I'm in here. They're just watching, waiting. God, you guys didn't take any blood samples and shit, How did you? you? Feel, Thomas? Who's shadows back there? Uh, I just got a headache. I, I'm I'm fine. Who, who the hell are you? Where am I? Don't worry. Everything is fine. You better get some rest. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not fine. Help me. Help me. Shoot me. Burn me. Something. Should I watch TV? What uh just lay down? Do I just, do I just lay back down? While you watch me? Ow! What is this? It's in me, isn't it? Lie down on the bed and get some rest. It'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. You've doomed us all, you fools! Oh, when I change, I'm gonna kill every one of you fuckers. We shall all become something more. Ow, my bones. Ow, ow. Uh, a butthole. What's... Thomas, are you okay? What do you fucking think? Do I look okay? I just heard a fart. It farted. Death farts. Yeah, I'm I'm very far from okay, obviously. I don't know why there's blood spraying everywhere. It's free. Thomas didn't get laid. <laughs> that was so amazing. <laughs> that was high quality AAA action right there. Amazing. Amazing. Um, uh, this should be the credits. Uh, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. Do all those things to help. And uh, Tom Cuck made this. Just Tom. Just him all by himself. In front of other people, obviously. But uh, we'll, we'll, 
We'll see you in the next one.